allowing him to keep going around, it's a conflict of interest in this right now. I'll go back up to him. Stop him right now while this is under discussion. Okay, Chris. Yesterday. Uh, okay. You're not going to talk to me? I want you to do something about this until this is resolved between us. I'm trying to stop him. Stop him right now. I'm he can wait a few minutes while we discuss this, correct? I can talk to okay, him. Okay, right please now. stop him. You can go talk to them. Chris, you know that they gave you the notice? Yes. You have 24 hours to remove it from public property. It's in my hands. Huh? It's not stored on public property. Look at the words. It says stored on public property. It is not stored when it's in my hands. Okay, so he illegally ripped that from my hands. It's stored property. Not just items being around. It's stored property. Look at the, the city ordinance. Okay, and it's in my hands being removed. It even states in there if we're able to carry it away. Corporate counsel is even saying. I can show you the video from the corporate counsel themselves. I'm just trying to they walked up over here. It wasn't in your no, it wasn't sitting over there. They carried it there. Wes Chunk ripped it out of my hands. You guys are all sitting over here. Right on the lawn. Okay. You cannot just come up and take it when it's removed. Because if that's the case, the people with the dogs in it, you should have tagged them. You should have tagged them if nobody can have a chair here. Well, I'm pissed though because he just he just was able to assault me, and you're not doing nothing about it. Well, Chris, I didn't. I didn't. You see that individual sitting right there? Is anybody tagging them? No. Why? Because they have a chair and they're just u utilizing the park legally, correct? If I have a chair sitting there and I'm utilizing it legally and I pick that chair up and walk away, it is still being used. It is not stored. For him to run up and steal it from me and take it out of forcefully, rip it out of my hands. Billy. Oh, we got it. And there's plenty of witnesses, and you just saw him fight with him over the other chair. He wasn't fighting with them. Bullshit! He, Bullshit! He, he, Bullshit! He, he removed his cuffs and threatened to arrest me. I was talking to you. I want a report from No! Don't he took it out of my hands and threatened to arrest me. I, always, I have liked you from the beginning. Okay. I don't disrespect you for a reason. Okay. But you saw him pulling that chair from him while he was trying to pull it back. And that's when all the yelling was going. So don't say you didn't see him fighting with him over it. That guy there was forcefully taking stuff from people and assaulting them. And if he touches another item, I will step in. Stop him. He needs to stop the conflict of interest. He's went out of his guidelines. I want a file charge. I want this guy charged for criminal assault. Now. I gotta get a battery pack out, can you? I got mine. You have your good yeah, hands out. You got it? Well, I've been drinking a lot of coffee, so I'm a little shaky. Bear with me, audience. That person over there is able to sit there. What? <laughs> Not when it's being used. They can't take a chair like that. So what do I got to do? I got to file a police report. You can talk to whoever you'd like to. But as, as far as this, I mean, I'm not, I, I can't say definition, I don't, I don't what, you know, I'm not going to say word game. That's your job, yeah, I'm not talking about word games, yeah. I mean, you're here to enforce the law. Are you not? Sure. The item that dealt with in question.
was marked. Okay. My okay. question to you is, are you here to enforce the law or to be bodyguard for them? I'm just here to just keep Okay. But, but you're an officer, right? So yes, you're supposed to be enforcing the law. So the law is, telling you that the law is warned, and it's still there, then it can be taken That's actually the not the law. No. The law is... I'd like to file assault charges as well. Not with them walking away, because the last time you guys did that, I didn't see it for over two months. So no, they can't leave. That's taking away evidence. I'm not going to allow it. I'm not going to allow it. You fucked me the last time. Chris, you fucked me the last time. I still haven't received one of the items that I that was taken don't that's say, been told don't, that it could come to me. Don't say I did that to you. I didn't do that to because, you. Because, well, no, you personally did not. But your department is allowing this shit no, to happen. I'm putting it right here right now, okay? So somebody's coming down. Okay. Because they're not walking away with it this time. Okay. He still has my bullhorn. Okay, well, Chris, you know, the blue horn, I'm, I'm not... He wrote me a letter, an email saying that I could take it any time, but have I gotten it yet? Hell no! Okay, I, and I understand that, I understand that, but he still holds on to the shit. He's not giving it up. Uh, I just need, I'm trying to talk to you. I just want to make sure that I know who the officers were here today. They know what to do. Well, I mean, it's from... Whoa, whoa, whoa! That's illegal search of seizure, and that was by the Ninth uh, District Court, Federal Court. No way can they just go into that. Ninth District Federal Court, San Francisco, just said that you are not lawfully able to go into someone's home. That's illegal. Can you see that? Yeah, Ninth yeah, District Federal to Court, the, way, the people that run your court system. No Stop allowing illegal activity. You know you can't go into someone's home. That's all I'm asking you, just to back up. Don't touch a police officer. What? Don't touch a police officer. I didn't touch a police officer. What are you trying to tell me? Who are you, my dad? No, tell him this. I wasn't talking to him. I wasn't talking to him. That's all I'm asking you to do. Just back up. I did. Five feet. I'm more than five feet. You don't have to yell at me. Okay, so just keep back up. That's unlawful. That's going on, and you know it. You know it is. He cannot do that. That's why you guys stopped Chris, from the very first stay one. There, Nova, okay? I'm staying here. Yeah, just stay there. That's it. That's all I'm asking you to do. Well, I'm asking you to stop that. That's why I told you to stop him from doing what he's doing. He's going outside his bounds. He's not lawfully able to do that. That is a domicile. It was closed. You do not have a search warrant for it. I'm standing here watching them break the law. What exactly is your function here? unable to prove without a doubt that that piece of item that's on that sidewalk is the same freaking tent that's sitting there. On top of it, it has been found by a federal judge in New York that we are able to even sleep on private property 
as long as it's a normal walk. So this law, and this, what he's doing right now, is illegal in so many different ways. Federal court for all this time. You guys, I'm pretty sure somebody in this country knows that just by going into someone's court. You can't walk into someone's house without a state court. Okay, so if this is here for over 24 hours, where's the law to go in? Uh, you guys are, but you guys are the enforcement of the law. They're just doing what they're told. You guys know what the law is. In this country, that's the contradiction of the law. Okay. And are they following the law? Yeah, but are they are they are they following the law? No, 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 no. See, that's where you guys should be able to step in and say, no, you're doing wrong. I, I fully I fully support you guys going around and doing your job. I do. I really do. But when the law is being broken, clearly, that's why you guys are here to keep the peace. Because I wouldn't have nothing to yell at if you're doing what's lawful. All right? If, if, if what he was doing was legal, I'd have no justification to be screaming and shouting about anything. I'd just be a raving lunatic. That's breaking the law. And you guys are allowing it. Pretty good. Yeah, I don't know. First, everybody calls it a real thing. Yeah. Uh, they're doing a Bill 54 thing, and they just uh, physically assaulted me and my brother. They uh, take their, just went into a tent that is a little hole at federal courts and decided to remove stuff out of it without a warrant. It's a lot easier to handle this now. I mean, yeah. you start getting into civil and federal yeah. litigation. On this stuff, I mean, it's illegal. You have, I mean, you sat there and watched that gentleman over there take items out of my person. You watched that. You were standing right there. Well, one of your officers pulled out his handcuffs and threatened to arrest me. So I'm supposed to deal with that? You can just arrest me at will? You know, that's not right. That's not right. Your officers don't know what the law is. Well, you know, and on, on top of your chair, it had the notice of removal. Well, just the, the, okay. Yeah, and it wasn't like being stored. Huh? It wasn't it being stored. Like he, he had no right. He had no right. It's not supposed to be on the public property in the park. He had no right. It wasn't on the property. It was in my hand. It was in the property. Sir. No. Yes, it was. No, it was not being stored. It was in the property. Okay. It's, I'm telling you right now, it's, it's ten times worse for you guys if we have to deal with... With this you know taking what? place, right? It was set up over here. It was set up over here when we walked in. Yeah. Okay. Is that my issue with you? It was in my hand, and it was in my possession. Was it? In, was it or was it not in the park? Honestly, it was in my possession. Was it? Okay. What about all those people? Come on, man. No, it's it's selected. That's fine. If if you want to uphold it, that's fine. But I take issue. I take issue with the fact. That when I question the law, which is my right okay. to question the law and what it is and what it entails, when I have an officer who pops his handcuffs out at me in a threatening manner, like he's going to take me away in a squad car, that's where I draw the line. There is no cause for that. None. Well, all, all while, he, while I was being assaulted, I was the victim, and they threatened to arrest me. Not defuse the situation, not try and justify it, even though it's, it's a ridiculous justification. And an illegal justification. No. His first instinct was to pop his cuffs to put me in handcuffs. Now I'd have to go downtown, get fingerprinting, do all that stupid crap or whatever, and then fight it up. Because it's not worth my time and effort. He clearly broke the law, and it was easier to defuse the situation by complying, but I was under duress, forced to remove to let him remove the property and to allow him to assault me and you guys are allowing it. I can't say that you were forced to do it. I think you willingly did it. I willing under duress. That is not willingly. Because I had to make a snap decision right away on whether or not it was worth my time and effort to fight it through the courts while I was in handcuffs. I was ordered to do it. He wasn't handcuffed. No, I wasn't hand. They they were trying yeah, to. He was threatened to. Yeah. Well, That's man, absolutely that's ridiculous for, for questioning the law. You guys are definitely interjecting yeah, themselves and protecting them and nothing about it. And I want a restraining order against that gentleman. 
I would like a restraining order against that gentleman for assaulting me. And I'd like a restraining order against that police officer. But because these officers won't allow me that right, I can't do that. I don't ever want to have to see that gentleman again. Okay, that's cool. But this right here should have been stopped. They can hold off a few minutes if you can make me hold off. That guy committed assault. That wasn't an assault. No. Uh, when he forcefully takes a chair and goes like that and rips it out of my hands, yes. If I touch you, it's assault. Okay? If I touch you, it is assault. He grabs a hold of something of mine and uses that against me and pushes me off with it and takes it out of my hands. Assault. He used a weapon to do it, as far as I'm concerned. Civilly, Wesley Chum. These are the ones that we go after for the courts on on government. You're civil. You're civilly liable. Oh, that's that's oh I'm more than five feet away from you, man. <laughs> don't, don't get worried now. You're all big and bad back there. Yeah. Wait, my dad. You got it? You sure? You, you sure? You're gonna... Okay. It's not right. It could, it could have been handled a lot differently. You guys have a job to do, and I'm not out here trying to bust your balls about it, but... I don't want to ever have to see that gentleman again. That was absolutely ridiculous, and I certainly want to file a complaint against that officer. All I was doing was questioning the law. So, I want a restraining order against him, and I want to file a formal complaint when against him. restraining order, you got to go to the court and do that. That's fine. Okay. Where's the complaint form for that officer? And I need I need his badge number. Honolulu. You got his badge number, right? This gentleman right here? Yeah. Great. Fucking pop your cuffs or whatever like you're big and bad for questioning the law. It's bullshit. No, I got it, man. It's fine. No, I'm I'm good. I got it. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Thank you. Hey, can you keep that cardboard since it wasn't tagged? Yeah. Yeah. Actually, hey. And actually, all the stuff that was in that tent that wasn't tagged, because I believe all that stuff that was in the tent was on private property. Yeah. What about that deal too? That's been another big question about it. it supposedly, corporate counsel said you had to tag each and every item. Each and every item. They just, they're taking stuff left and right without any way. Well, you, you know the law, man. You see the law. I mean, come on. What is it? Uh, what, what is it? HR uh, 11 029. It's a statute. You should know it if you're going to enforce it. Yeah, I see it. Do you have it? You can walk around, man. Stay the hell away from me. Oh, no, he's aggressive. I don't give a shit. As he's holding stuff in his hands doing that. You keep bitching at everybody else about five feet. Walk keep five feet away. Keep threatening with weapons, dude. Don't think the police are able to protect I don't think you're within five. I think you're within five feet. Don't fucking smirk at me. Yeah. The yeah, fuck is your right. problem? We know what would happen if you're wandering around. We know you can find that information <laughs> Fucking bullshit. You gonna sit here and try and intimidate me now? The I mean, fuck you think you are? The person that within properties that are worth over millions of dollars only pays thirty-five thousand on uh, property taxes. His property oh. taxes is listed on his property as thirty-five thousand. <laughs> I, I don't know how you can do that. Who wants to start it? Who wants to start it? You don't really have enough for a mic. I'll still do it. Oh. What's the...
thought you were waiting for supervisors. Why are we loading stuff into a truck? Or is that just bullshit too? Such description may refer to an attached photograph. Definitely not one of your tag pins, so stop spreading. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine. No, not you, not you. They're, they're, oh. they're paying attention to it. That's definitely not one of them. <laughs> There's only one that close, closely resembles one of the ones they tagged, and that's the one they call them. So to try and say anything else here is kind of nuts. How can you even tag right away in it? I think that's what they're doing. Oh, yeah, no, they do that. Because well, stuff is here and they want to give notice, but they won't give notice to that person in the car. I thought it has to be here they for 24 hours, right so don't phone. you have to come back tomorrow? Selective to enforcement. If you can tag us right now, just knowing that it was just here, you should be tagging everyone in this park equally. Yeah. But since you, you don't yeah, want to I don't, do that, I don't like, I don't like the dogs and crap running around. Why don't they're you right. go tag them? People are allowed to stay overnight here, and it's except for Hawaiians or protesters. You boot them out when they have overnight permits. But the dog people, they can have people stay overnight in the parks. They can have more than two sides on a, on a tent and not be questioned because they're not Hawaiian yeah, I'd like to make or protesters. People using the parks with stuff. Yeah. Get that tag. Please. Yeah. yeah, you're gonna, I mean, it's, Equal opportunity, I guess you would say, huh? It's definitely Bus Chung's opportunity. It's become his, his department store. Well, why do they store. take it? <laughs> he picks what he wants. He chooses what he You cannot just go up to a park user just because they're in the park and, and tag give them a notice. Actually, they, you can. Actually, That's what you're doing right now. They're tagging tents. Well, what, 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 yeah, for what, instance, none of these tents have been, uh, None of these have been here for 24 hours. hours. But That's why they're giving it a notice. But that's what I'm saying. So, so you're going to notice this. So you're gonna notice them as well, correct? Yeah, it's thing, no, right? it's the same thing. It is. It's it's exactly the same thing. We don't stay overnight in the park. Uh, it doesn't say anything. Does. It doesn't. No, it doesn't. No, that, that is not the park. No, this is a city. Right. 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 That's right. The right. And well, that's what that's not the park. Floor is right. No, 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 no. Right. That right there is in violation. If you're tagging us right away, that's in violation too. Hang on. Yep. Hang on. Hi. Oh. Say hi to the internet. Working. I'm a dirty hippie. I got nothing better no, it to do is. than it's the It's a city ordinance. It's not even a Hawaii device. It's an actual city ordinance. They have to be the ones that enforce it. It's only city. It has nothing to do with the state. Right. It's not state level. It's all... Well, that is city there. This is state. Yeah. And they got their own set of laws. But. What are they doing over here? 
Yeah, that's all they do, right? That sidewalk's expensive. You probably don't want to bust it up. Well, no, because they haven't fixed anything yet, but they are tearing, tearing Barry Canyon up when Ward is all screwed up. That's my rock. Has it been tagged? Even though Barry yeah. Canyon Have you tagged that rock? Excuse me, officer. He's removing stuff that hasn't been, been tagged. tagged. He just removed my rock. Oh, a tripping hazard? Is that what that is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just because you say it's a tripping hazard doesn't make it so. Yo, Where is the statute rock? that says it's a tripping, tripping hazard? It's a tripping hazard because you keep us away from our property. <laughs> <laughs> so you want to be liable for that one? For causing public harm? The tripping hazard over there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I should walk over there actually. It's all right. I don't think I I don't think they can keep me from being walking over there like they keep trying to make me. Yeah, yeah. Just start tripping over stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, he's him too, because he's one of the Yeah. Can you wait right here? Uh -huh. Yeah. I told you, I don't, I don't go big with you. Yeah, do I don't want to go big with you. I don't want to go big with you. Okay. Well, we're going to get this shit straight now. Oh, you're here. Go ahead. Yeah, well, just in case, I have a question, so I'll give it right back to you. Go ahead. I'll give it right back to you, I promise. That's awesome. That's awesome. See, you do that. Let's go. I'll give it right back to you, man. What is it? You want to book him? I think I did. Oh. Okay, here. So whoever just decided to tune in, um, they basically came to do raid 15, <laughs> and uh, during that process they took a chair from my from my hands that I was carrying, and uh, he basically used the chair to forcibly push me off and rip it from me, committing assault. He also did it to another one of the protesters here, and then uh, our free speech table, where they've always set up a if it was manned in the chair because it's in use, because it's not stored if it's in use, we all right, they took that from them too. So now they're doing illegal stuff just like we thought they would. They're not following by their guidelines because they know we beat them everywhere else. Um, so right now, we had the police department all discussing with Wesley Chung about his actions on what should be done. And uh, though I may have a small chance of getting the two chairs back for me and the other protester, I don't think they're really wanting to pursue it any further even though both of us are wanting to press charges for assault and uh i mean they know i'm telling the truth i've already called the police on the police once before <laughs> and we've seen what happened there so they're up in arms trying to figure out what's going on should i call them huh should i call the police uh well they're here right now we'll just see what happens the okay. one guy's pretty cool give him a chance he tries it doesn't always work but he tries Yes, and, and I, before you guys leave, I would like to file an assault report on this gentleman right here, an intimidation. Yeah, they're documenting the case, okay, and we'll get to Okay, well, I, I, want a case, I want a report number, and I, yes. I am filing assault because I intend to file a restraining order against that gentleman. So they will make, and then if you want, you can make a statement, yeah, okay. and they can attach that to the police report. Okay. And okay. then the other chair, they're, I mean, that, they're giving that one back to you, and then the other chair, they're going to take that. Which one? The black one? The yellow one? The yellow one. Yeah, the yellow one. Why? Because, um... They're, they're going to keep doing it. They're saying that it was actually leaning against the tree, so as they grabbed it, then you grabbed it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, the red one he made me put down. Anyway, we're going to document that one, too. So you also can make a statement. Uh, 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 u
Yeah, Gordon, he made me sit down. He made me sit down the red chair. What about the chair that he was sitting on? That was been used in the red chair that they, they made, made him me take down. They made me okay, sit well, it down. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm only knowing about this chair. Yeah. Can you bring up that one real quick? What is what is okay, the black chair that I was sitting in at the Yep. And the red chair that he was carrying. Yep. See, they they never done this kind of activity before. You've been here so many times. They never done this before because they've always said at the information booth, this man, they won't take anything because it's freedom of speech. Well, they forced I'm not them off. sure if they're doing that because when we came up on to the um, park today, that nobody was at the information booth. I was. He was at the information booth. Yes. Okay. Like, and you were sitting on the back for the entire time? Yes. And I only got up under duress. Okay. Hang on. I told you, I told you, buddy. I'm small, but three. I got my chair back. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear him? Wesley Chung was like, I need that individual's name because he's claiming ownership of the chair. So? Yeah. In case they see it again. Right. Hey, yeah, here comes the lunchtime crowd. Maybe you ought to go, hey, what do you guys think about that? Well, that's because he's in full presumption that you're going to be breaking the law somehow or you're going to leave your stuff all over. Instead of, you know, in America where you're... Uh, Proven guilty, you know, you, you have innocent until proven, proven guilty. Proven guilty. Innocent. Right. He's assuming that, well, you're guilty no matter what you do because, well, yeah. Because I like to hang out in parks. Because he, he, well, we also got to realize that his wife is the head attorney for uh, uh, anti union. Uh, what is the name but, of that group? I don't know, but she's a union buster. Yeah, she, she, she's like the head, head lawyer for the anti union movement that's around here, so. And then he sued the city in a land of million dollar properties and was able to get approved that his property is only worth 35000 because it's on a hill. I don't know, in America it seems like anything on a hill is worth more. It gives you seclusion. So. Well, those are the ones that have a story. Yeah. 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 They're finally taken. Nice of you to finally get rid of the garbage at least. Yeah. Thank you. Well, two of those chairs were some garbage, but they were laying there. That's a real job. Yeah. It's good to see them do the real job. Cleaning up people's garbage. That engineering degree did you good. <laughs> it's a, it's a, so good. I love that tin ring on your pinky. It means so much. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, shit. Yeah. These are the days. <laughs> they thought they were going to take some stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like the only... Oh, oh, oh! Hey, 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 hey! Whoa, that one's under dispute, guys. Hey! Come on, that's under dispute. Hold them up, guys. Are you serious? Let's see if he mistreats it. It's a hole. It's a hole of down back up there. The black chairs are taking. Why? Because of the fact that it was tagged as and, and And even though it's a, it's a informational table, you still can stay there. Stored property. Uh -huh. Stored. That's in right. use. Okay? Right. Okay. Right? So, and this is an ordinance. City ordinance. Okay, but you guys are the ones that need to be enforcing to make sure that they carry it out correctly. Okay, but yesterday it was there unmanned. Okay, that's yesterday. Okay, okay we're not going to argue. It was that. not unmanned. I was there yesterday when it was tagged. Not, well, not when they first walked up. So, okay. so I'm not going to argue that okay. way. When, you, when they first walked up, it wasn't. Okay. He sat down later. Okay. But today, it was definitely manned. So, if it's in use, even while you guys come up to see, it's not stored. Automatically, this doesn't apply. And that's what's been held since day one for almost six months now. You realize this, it's, we're just like a week shy of six months of doing this. So I think we all here know the law and the way this is supposed to be carried yeah. out. And this is abnormal. This is not okay. the way it was supposed to be done. But, but Chris, let's say they take this tent 
Okay. Okay. And then they came back 24 hours later and somebody's in the tent. Well, the, you got to look at it as stored property, and I don't believe anybody takes and locks themselves in a storage container, no, correct? But, but by right, they could take the tent. Okay, right? they could take the tank and they take the contents. Well, whatever is in, in the tent. No. I, I mean, if the person is in there, they grab whatever you need it, stuff they can grab. Right. Then everything that was just taken from us, okay. you just, your terms. No, I'm, I'm just saying. If we were know, able to carry it. Yeah. It, you just said if they were able to grab the stuff and leave, they were able to take anything else, correct? Okay, hang on, hang on, guys. Sorry. Hang on. Yeah. So, I'm just saying if somebody was sleeping in that tent, okay, and then they came 24 hours later, right? You know that we can take this. Right. right? Okay. Yes. So the same thing. The chair was tagged yesterday. Okay. Good. So if we come back 24 hours later and the tent chair is still there. If you're using that analogy, and yes, that's what you guys do if someone's sleeping in it, you take the tent, but it's no longer actually stored property. Although we haven't been fighting you guys on that one, just like you guys haven't been fighting us on the chair. But if you guys are going to push the chair incident, then we're going to push everything else because, in your own definition of stored property, someone sleeping in that tent is used. That doesn't mean stored. If it's used, it's stored. Stored is being left. It's it's there to be held because they're not they went somewhere else, like a storage property or something that you put in your closet or something that you leave in your car, like say CDs. You leave those CDs in your car because you want to store them there for use when you get back into your car. But, but when um, uh, some to talk to you here, we can we can walk off a little bit if he wants a little bit of privacy or whatever, but. You can't just pull you around. But uh, anyhow, you know, so we haven't been pushing that because there is that gray line of it's something that's sitting on city property. That's why we've been changing our tents on. I mean, it's obvious the tactics no, no, that right, we're right, doing. Right, right. And uh, so well, I'm we haven't pushed that. The, but, that's the same but if you're going to push that, then we're going to have to start pushing that. And you're going to see a lot of arguments because that right there, by the Ninth District Federal Court, is unlawful. Well, I'm just you don't have a warrant for I'm just telling you the reason why they took the Okay, chair and I want to see a warrant. I want to okay. see a warrant. For well, what, the chair? For the chair. Uh, uh, it's the illegal it's search and seizure. And I'll push it now, and your, your, if you're off, your uh, sergeant isn't able to take you care of that matter? Like yes, that'd be great. Okay, thank you. Hey. I think they're gonna wanna like talk to me and shit. Yeah. Oh, okay. So we walk up there and walk in. Or sitting on a blanket. 
sitting on the blanket with the stroller and everything. And once you get this from there, Okay. But you're going to be using the tent. No, none of these tents have been here for 24 hours. But you know what I mean? But the problem I mean, is, every incident is different. You cannot I get out of the fight. Today, if I get arrested for sitting in a chair and refuse to give it to you, tomorrow you can't use this same thing and say, well, he did this and this and this and work. But then no longer have to work. It's one instance per time, which means you come up with well, that's not completely true, but okay, go but, on. Well, yeah, unless I'm doing the same offense <laughs> over and over again. I was that's not completely true, but okay, I'm go on. I'm doing the same exact offense over and over again, right. yes. But this right now is a total separate incident. Correct. Okay? And to be able to tag that, the reason why I tagged it because it wasn't here for 24 hours, correct? So they're taking a presumption that they feel that this is going to be here for 24 hours when they know they can't assume or have knowledge of prior. It's every individual deal separate entity. And if that's the case, then why are people with dogs or people sitting in that park with their items not being tagged? I think it's doing apples and oranges. No, 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 no. Different no. Different. 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 I'm sorry, it's apples and oranges. Right? And, and then I want to talk to the supervisor. Alright, go ahead. No, I want them here. No, 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 I want them here. Because this is the incident and you're unlawfully allowing them to take property. No, no. Ninth District know. Federal Court says that it's illegal for you to do what you do. Huh? Yeah, well, maybe you should start thinking the same way. You guys are allowing them to do whatever and not to hold anything. This is more more illegal. More more illegal. I'm gonna go ahead and make a report on that. I just uh, we'll get the report up here. What's going on? I get the report on there on Monday and my identification number. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Thanks. It might be too late. You, you reported that took a chair from me, right? Or was it? Yes, chair. Okay, so um. So what what happened in your incident? Okay, give me one second. Or a, um, Andy. It's up to you on how you guys want to Can go. Can I uh, hand this off to you? Hi there. Hi there. Uh oh, you yeah, okay. Sorry. Are you uh, Yes. Yes. What did they take from me? He took a yellow chair from me. He forcibly took the chair, went like that, to push me off, and grabbed the whole thing and walked away. Okay. I'll get with you in a second. Okay, so what do you guys do? Here you go. Alright, before you talk to him. Who, me? Oh, no, no. Oh, oh okay. I think we're totally screwing up their day. We're definitely making our day hard. We made one claim. Look at that. Even in Hawaii, we get the same thing as what they do in Chicago. A little band-aid. <laughs> huh? Thank you, sir. <laughs> A band-aid. It's cool. It should have been with Scooby Doo though. I like Scooby Doo Bandy. <laughs> <laughs> <Grab a chair, laughs> Might as well. We got a bunch of them over there for everybody to use. We should all just sit down and wait. This could take a while. We grab a chair and then they grab a chair. Yeah, it's cool. You know, it's what we do. So you go prepared. Yeah. Well, you know, Michael Daly showed up just before. We got eight lucky viewers on this, too. <laughs> eight lucky viewers waiting to see what what is uh, HPD going to do with Occupy Honolulu. What's going to do next? Well, I to about this Whichever they want to uh, he won't be putting in cups today, I can guarantee oh, that. Yeah. It's okay. 
She can bail his ass out. Uh. <laughs> They're gonna. That intimidation. He's <laughs> boogie. <laughs> 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 We're giving them a job to do. We're giving them a job. Oh, no fun John's on his way to lunch. <laughs> no fun John. <laughs> yeah, we'll have no fun John day. Okay. We'd like to offer our guest chair. Oh, uh, this is like oh, total ruination of my battery. <laughs> I, I got a bigger one. Okay. Anyway, Michael Daly. This is like 45 minutes so far. Oh my lord. <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can talk to people. <laughs> Conversation. What up, yo? This is so hard to film in <laughs> tight. I'm not sure what they're doing over there. viewers. Like, it's not able to get on. I wonder if it actually connected to... There we go. <laughs> okay, what do we got? Day... What day is this? Anybody know? No, I mean, is it day 174, 175? Well, here, check out on your thing real quick. Go from November 5th and just count the weeks. Yeah, you've got 25 days Huh? So go from November 1st, or 5th, sorry, and just count the weeks past that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, so let's just ask you to share it. 4 times 7. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Plus however many access days. Oh, he's going to talk to him, I guess. Okay, raid. Or no, day. Day. 174. <laughs> Do you remember the was there an, what, what, did any officer make contact with the officer? No, no officer make contact with the officer. No police officer at any time will be in the That's a question. Okay.
Thank Someone want to take this, Andy? Yeah. So I could talk to this gentleman without ha him having to worry about anything? Please? I thought you were talking to him, that's why I saw it. I for your people. Yeah, I know. I just the wall, they can't take that. they don't take anything out here. You don't want your social security number out on the internet, do you? <laughs> Can you, uh, Damien? National Lawyers Guild and we'll be okay. Where I'm are you? Where are you? I'm surprised that there isn't out in well, Hawaii. We use them oh, a lot in Chicago. Hey. <laughs> so right now we're we're waiting for uh, Nova to okay, get done. Shameless plug, come down to Thomas Square for May Day, uh, and uh, we're gonna have live music and uh, brunch. Uh, we definitely want all the police, all the city, um, all the one percent down there because we know that they need to get their groove on just like the rest of us, so Mayday, we're going to be 100% sun. I don't know, no fun chum seems like he'd be a car party crasher. No, no, he just needs to get laid, that's all it is, dude, and maybe we can facilitate that. It's like start tagging guitars as they're being played, yeah. yeah. That's all it is. So... that I put it down for a second. So he ran up, and I was like, whoa, no. And he takes it forcibly, grabs a hold of that chair, and forces it back at me and rips it out of my hand. Sorry, one of two things. Either he just stole that from me and used the weapon to do it, or did it this one? Uh, Wesley Chunk. Or it, it was just, uh, what was the other one that I was... Yeah, okay, he either forcibly take it, use it, yeah, theft with uh with the weapon or he just Assault. It's a, yeah, assault. It's I mean <laughs> I mean I try to be nice and say it was just assault, but they don't want to do anything about it and I'm like, Okay then, uh well then it comes down to where he it's theft. Because it's in my person, it's in my hand. You know, this is my stuff. You can't rip my bag off of me. He's had further instances where he's hit people on the back of the your backpack that's on them. That's assault. You can't allow that kind of activity. 
Now, the state, or not, sorry, not the state, but the city and the corporate council, which is the lawyers for this time, even had a big thing that, when deciding this, saying that people was able to hold their stuff and walk away. It's obviously not stored, because the big claim word is stored. Okay? I'm holding it. You can't take it from me. This isn't your personal department store, and you definitely can't use that chair against me. Okay. So, I I'm looking for charges, and I want to press, and I and um, do not want to buffalo it over like Hold on. Damien? And the last time I did do a report, uh, I, I don't know. I guess I got to talk to this officer. Oh, so. uh, Three months in a row, why hasn't that been changed? Because it was directly a theft that happened that day. This is another one, but now it's supposed to be done. Or better still, inform an officer. I said better still inform an officer. Sorry. You know, and that's where the problem comes. The officers that are here are doing a good job of trying to maintain peace. But this is a city ordinance, regardless. And who enforces the city ordinance? Who has to make sure that the city ordinances are being upheld? In every state I've ever lived, any country, the officer comes up to find out if it's even a violation. Here, they have city workers that come up and decide whatever, and the police stand there and find it and just watch. That's not right. That's not protecting anyone. You know, they're there to protect the city people, obviously. They're doing nothing for us. Now we've had uh, two past assaults and then two today. Are we going to keep going with this or are we going to do something about it? This gentleman has gone out of this room. And as the 9th District Federal Court of San Francisco flat out said, those are people that control the court. This is unlawful. Well, this this right is here. unlawful. Now, guys, you want to push it. You want to bring the power to everybody's worried about. Can you hold it or should I have to do We're doing things right. That's all we're asking. You know, I, the officers here, the ones that are here today, I have to push it. There's only been a couple times before the next one. For the most part, I don't know. Again. He's just here doing his job. But with that, I think there has to be the other step of they have to be looking towards the people that the offender is coming to law enforcement and protect the DFN. You know, if the DFN comes up into my face, it's okay. If I walk within five feet of him, that's a that's bad. No, you can't infringe on my space. You can't push me around and scream and shout at me like Weston Chunky. You can't threaten me like it's on video camera today like Weston Chunky. And that's what kept raising my voice when he kept filming up too. He thinks he's really badass. You're going to threaten me because you have officers here. You're going to create another scenario. And that's not good for the city. On any, any level. You know, even if it is just five people that's wanting to make the stand. That's five people that get, you know. I don't know if I'm going to on the wall over there. No, not on the wall. Right yeah. up against that, that tree there. You can see right here. Or the one way down there. Or the one way down there. No, 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 you know, I mean, it's, it's like the officer said, if I just, yeah. if I took, if I walked up and stood this radio, sure, I can make a little show on this, but I'm not going to do it. Do you want to do it? No, this is good. Whatever you want to do, so are you injured? 
As you can see, they're having a little powwow on the steps. Not unusual. Live from Thomas Square Park. We're just going through another raid. Sergeant talking to Nova. Now we've got perhaps an, an officer officer involved here. Someone of higher rank. Just about today, and we won't bring up pants. Yeah. Just today, if I'm holding a chair and he doesn't like that I have this chair, okay, and he grabs a hold of the chair and he uses that to shove up against me, I'm not. But I, I should be able to talk to you reasonably. Are you yeah. Are you concerned that I'm going to do something yeah. to you? No, I just don't have anyone to be speak. Well, but you guys do it to us all the time, so. I'm talking to you very personally. Okay. Well, still, for me to be able. I'm, Don't make me try to protest you. Okay, so, so stop. When he takes a chair, and he takes a chair and shoves it up against me, and rips it out of my hand, what is that? Yes. What, what would that be? I'm using it, and I'm able to carry it away. It's a store. No, they're refusing to give it back to me. If I'm if I'm using it or if I'm carrying it, is that store? No, it's my property. It's not their property. No, 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 no. See, that's the process. Because right now, for over two months, I've been trying to get a bullhorn that I even have written authorization from Leslie Jones saying it's mine that I can have it. But he's refused to give it to me. Still. No, he actually, that's when HPD took it upon themselves to go on private property that we have permission for and steal our items from us on private property. Okay, that's the kind of stuff we're dealing with out here. You may not be here under day for it, but when we have individuals chasing us down on private property, first off, you're not allowed to go on someone's private property unless you're actually authorized. Like, they invite you, they ask you, so they storm truth in after us. And then after the owners coerce them into getting them to say, fine, we, we won't give them permission because they were screaming in their face so much. Now, one of those items, I was told because of that whole incident, yes, that is lawfully yours. But have I received it? No. And I have it in writing from us, Chun, that it is one. And that I can have it at any time. But he does whatever he can to keep it from us. So, no, we can't allow them to just take stuff because they will not give it to us. That's stuff. For him to grab an item out of my hands and use a metal object against me is a weapon, correct? 
if I take a metal chair and smack you on the head or hit you with it, is that not considered now a weapon? No, no, he admits it. He admits it the same thing. He just admitted to the other officer. So I don't want to hear that. Later. The process would be free to get the back here because they they keep breaking the law. My deal is not the property. I know how I'm supposed to obtain that even though it doesn't happen. My deal is that I want someone in handcuffs for assault with a pressing charge. Now, if you don't want to go with assault with the same theft, what's a deadly weapon? Okay, well, I thought you were going to spend on the property. That's what you're going to do. You did that last time. I'm on the neighborhood board, and you guys didn't even write it up as theft. You guys blew it off as misleading. We're going to document that right now. It's what? Theft? No. no, it is a crime. I want it to be a crime. I am filing a, a charge against it as a crime. And I, myself, have the ability, even when those officers told me I was not lawfully able to go up to, I do have the ability of citizen's arrest. That person should be under your, citizen's arrest. Your recourse against me is against you. I have no problems with you individually. Well, with the recourse that we have in general. Normally, what the police are here to do is maintain the law. No, you're, you're in force laws. Well, in this case, the law is not enforceable in terms of the city. Why? It's a city order. It's a city that the city is designed so that the city people can be warning and help us with the property, right? So, you have government officials that are now legal thieves. Well, I want this job. What degree entitles me to be a legal thief and use violence? I want this job. We can talk theory and all that kind of thing. You will call the police. Well, I want to stop the report because I want the guy arrested. No, there will be. There should be. You can't deny me that right. That is my right. That is my right. Why are you denying me my right? That's all I want to know. A city official? I could have put him on their citizen's arrest. You know I'm a prior officer, right? Well, I'm just supporting you, so you know. Don't try to bullshit me, please. Okay, the guy could have been placed on the citizen's arrest. You guys couldn't have been able to do anything about it because you would have had to file a report for an arrest, a citizen's arrest. And I've been the one that would have been pressing charges under that, right? I'm the one that would have to go to court for it because I arrested him myself, which I am legally entitled to. But because your officer is denying me that, you guys are taking the responsibility of doing it. So, do it. So, your request, sir, is to make the police department pay. So, you guys are consistently against all wines and protests. Because you guys have kicked people out that have permits, but allow other individuals that have permits. You allow those people there without being tagged. But to tag, all right. If you're here to enforce and maintain the peace, you watch this. What? That they have more rights than us? There is no difference. Because each and every time that they come as an individual case, all right? Okay, this is Lord Brock. Yeah, but guess who comes out here to do it? The FN. Both entities. It's the same individual. So, they can't sit there and just legally say, okay, it's all good. Because this is public property, correct? And it states in the city ordinance, which we do have a copy of that gentleman, it states parts also. So, the same laws that's going on on this sidewalk is the title of the park. And we've had that used against us. So, we know that. So, you can't use that and say, well, no, they're protected on the different laws. It's the same ones. Because they've been used against us. We've had items in this park that they take. So, if we are going to be treated that way, why is the rest of the public? Why are you singling us out? I just explained it, but you're trying not to understand me. No, no, no. No, you're trying to avoid the case that we've actually been... I'm not avoiding any case, sir. If you have a problem with what we're doing or we, contact the police commission or internal affairs. Okay? If you want your stuff... So, you're denying me my public right to safety. There is a process. That's all I want to know. You're denying me my right to safety. You're denying me my right to safety when a person is able to come up to me several times and use force, now a weapon against me. I'm giving you options to make a statement. 
you know what? To make it a miscellaneous and statement, it and not a criminal offense. Correct. If I use, if I take that from you, it's theft. If I take that 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 from you and use it against you and hit you with it, it's assault. If not, with a weapon of some sort. You, there's many ways to go around this, and it all depends on how you want to handle it. Correct. Correct. Well, in either case, a law was broken, and that's what he did, and you're allowing it, and you're allo you're allowing him. You, I'm not allowing it. I'm allowing you by grading it up as miscellaneous and blowing it off when he to, when he criminally I'm violated my you rights. To make a statement and to get a document. That's, that's the bottom line. Sir. No, no, that's not the bottom line. You're avoiding what you know is proven that you should be doing because if I can do it against you, he can't do it against me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you can arrest him. Why? You're denying my public safety, my right to public safety. Wait, that's not something to just blow off. So you don't want to write your statement? Oh, I want to write my statement. Okay. But what I want, that. I want documented that you have just agreed that you are denying me my public right to safety. I believe I said I'm allowing you to make a statement. You're allowing me to make a statement and not do anything about it. When I asked about my public safety, you said no. So what does that mean? You are denying me my public right to safety. Okay. Whatever you want to That's say, what sir. you said. It's on camera. Yes, it's on camera. Okay, so you're agreeing to it. I'm not Thank you. Anything. You just did. You said yes. Thank you, sir. And you guys are going to allow that? He just agreed that we do not have public right to safety? He just said yes. He didn't agree to that because he agreed that okay, he knows that it's on me. camera. He, said he agreed that he knows that you guys are filming this. And he knows and he agreed that he made that statement. So I want this document. Wait, what statement did you say I made? Sir? I asked you if you were denying me my right to public safety. You said yes. I said I'm allowing you to write a statement. And denying you. You're allowing a man to criminally violate my my safety. You can you can twist it your own. It's not twisting. He want, used sir. a weapon against me. Well, and we're giving you the option. We're giving you uh, the option to write a statement. If I can get to someone using handcuffs of me and throw me in jail. Damon, Damon, right? Damon's because over. he's a city official. Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? No, it's not this. It's not different. He's a civilian. He's a civilian. Okay. Even if it was you or you or him, same laws, man. You can't just physically beat on someone. Please come here and you turn off your people. Yeah, you're denying me my right to public safety, correct? No. No? So do something about it, please. No, are you going to do something about it in the same manner as what you want to treat me? It's simple, man. That's all it is. I don't want to fight with you because I have no personal problems with the police department. I was one for several years. But when you're denying me civilians the right of the same right for personal problems, well, we're going to get before we leave. For their own freedom. Give me another two by two. He's going to get you. Get your two by two and fill up. I need one. No, 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 no. I said he picked that chair. He grabbed the chair and used that against me. Right. He pushed me up against me. I said that. I've been saying that all the time. But you weren't physically injured in any way, and you weren't going to make a... It's still assault. It's still assault. Oh, really? Then how come I... It's assault if I touch him. If I touch him, it's assault. He even said it. He touched me. I read the comment. Oh, I'm so sorry. No problem. Okay? And then you said one inch. Oh, okay. That myself... No, you're trying to pull me away from this. Uh, I need to talk to you. Okay. You're going to take care of it. I'm, I'm the one taking care of it right now. I want to make sure this officer right here is the one that told me it is assault. It is assault. Now, the other officer wants to blow it off that's a supervisor. Yeah, you. We do have a personal problem now. Sorry, sir. Sorry, I got it. I'm the supervisor. No, that... Don't lie to me, then. Because they told me it was him. Are you the supervisor? Okay, so who are you? I'm their supervisor. He's the watch supervisor. Okay, well, then you need to control that, right? No, 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 no. Control that right now. We're setting up precedence because I'm tired of getting abused by your officers. You are allowing city officials and certain officers to do activities here that's illegal. No, no, no. Why are you letting them go? This needs to be addressed, man. Well, I'm here to address you, okay? <laughs> yeah, because you're denying me my rights, too. This is simple. Yeah, I, I have it, and I'm more willing to write it. I won't need an extension. I got it.
Yeah, I really won't. I won't. This is gonna be short and easy. No, we've already been down that trip, man. We've already been down that trip. You guys just keep pushing it off. I know that because I'm on the neighborhood of the court. I've seen where the reports go. Your officers have come up and talked to us and told us. That's a problem. The ones that come to the neighborhood for 10. When they're writing up this miscellaneous and this criminal activity, when it's not being put in the proper course, we got we got paperwork to show that you guys have been fudging your marks. Now you guys can sit there and allow an officer to tell me that it is assault. If I touch you. But it is an assault when a city official touches me? Huh? Okay, now if I if I take that pin from you and use it against you, what is it? If I take this and I push it up against you, I mean I, I'm taking it. Boom! I'm not gonna do that. And get myself arrested? What are you trying to do, man? You're trying to set me up now? I will tell you. No, you're trying to set me up. If I take this and I push it up against you, chat. If I push it up against you, what is it? What is it? What is it? in my hand. How is it stored? What is the definition of stored property? Stored. I'm leaving it there. I'm leaving it. I'm not doing anything with it. It's stored, man. Uh, oh, I gave you yours, right, sir? Give me what? Okay. Yeah, so I'll talk to you more about that. Let me put this in. Yeah, you guys are blowing it off. Okay. They, uh, I guess they mean. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, Thanks. Thanks. Uh, and then, you know, I'll give you some, I'll give you some helpful hints to help. <laughs> okay? Okay. Yeah, you guys are blowing it off. Okay. We'll shut down everything. We'll all talk. And I'll, I'll talk to you some helpful hints. That may assist you. Okay. Today is the 28th. Today is the 28th. Filling out incident reports. That's where all our trees go.
Pow wow, pow wow. Okay, thanks a lot. Checking IDs and having them fill out papers on the incident of stolen chairs and properties from the Deoccupy movement here in Thomas Square Park, Honolulu. Reports. Claim an incident. Did you write a statement? Because there was a. No, I haven't. Okay, I need you to get a statement. Pass <laughs> the camera. Passing cameras around as we write reports. Oh, okay. We're gonna get some more forms if maybe we ran out of forms. You know what I need you to do for me real quick? Yes, sir. I need you to put a line through that. I need you to put down, I, I am not injured. I was not injured during this incident. Like physically injured? Yeah, because I'm under emotional distress. Well, no, physically injured. I'll write, yeah, that I'm, I'll write that I'm not physically injured, but I was okay. intimated by your officer and Mr. Chun. That's fine. I'm gonna go. Well, he's not an officer. He's a city, city worker. Yeah, the officer that popped his cuff. Oh, yeah, that's... Shit. That facilitated a crime taking place. You're not physically injured.
Who's scaring you? Why? Why? He's a good guy. He's cool. Okay. Yeah, he's going to put a line through that an initial. Line, like? Yeah. yeah, no, right through, nothing follows, right there. Like that? Yeah, right, that, that's it, and then put an initial right there at the end. Okay. Right? Okay. I am not physically injured, okay? And I need you write the word, nothing follows there. Okay. Make sense, huh? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Why did you say he was the rest D U R E S S? D U R? Yes, E S S. And you. Why did you say he was too late? Alright. Well, why did you say he was too late? Are you threatening to arrest me for interfering with a government action or some shit? <laughs> While Wesley Chun is like trying to forcibly remove property, I I so he, he's that. watching him steal yeah. from me, and then tells me that I'm going to be arrested. Yeah. Right. I put that all over. Yeah. I put that thing on there about the. Uh, okay. Then I'm on. You must have left nothing follows. What do you mean nothing follows? That just nothing follows after that. After that last period. Nothing falls, so that way there's, there's nothing going to be added, right? Okay. Cool. This is your pit. Or, uh, actually, I think it was him that gave me that. It might be his. Okay. I believe he's the one that gave Sorry, all I had is something really soft to write on it. Oh, Make okay. it real hard to write. <laughs> I didn't have nothing solid to write. Huh? Yeah, it's alright. Might not be completely legible, but it's, it, it can make sense to stop it somehow. <laughs> <laughs> it's real hard when you're writing on gel. It's kind of like, it's yeah. all moving funky. Yeah, it's I had like, to get a book out. It looks like a fucking second do. grader writing. Goo <laughs> 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 goo! I know, ABC. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what is your date and time right there? Oh, okay, I wasn't sure if that was uh, you or you. Oh. Oh. Right now it's 12.59. Thank you. This is a long one. Orin is going to complain about the length of this one. He's like, it took me two months to download. <laughs> You're up to 89 minutes. Holy fuck shit. <laughs> <coughs> At 312 kilobytes a second. Wow. They are not liking today. <laughs> well, they shouldn't allow the, the city to get stupid. I mean... They need to... They need to give some guidance on what they're allowed to do and they have to make it lawful and when they do their thing on protecting the peace it has to be on both sides you know if someone's committing a, committing an unlawful act they need to act on it to stop allowing this shit so if this if DFM is acting without any guidelines then it's our corporate counsel's fault you know especially if uh, that's what's being deemed by the police that the corporate council was wanting, you know, so it's kind of like, it's either corporate council that's allowing the freedom of abiding by law, you know, not to abide by law, or it's DFM acting on themselves, and the police are kind of caught in the center, but sooner or later, someone has to step up and say, yeah, this isn't right, but the one officer to come up and start threatening us, dude, now... 
get out of my face. <laughs> Well, wearing the same color. <laughs> okay, so that's that's um. So be classified as Miss Pub. That's your report you. number. What is a Miss Pub? Miscellaneous public. I mean, it's just a miscellaneous. No, report. it's very specific. I was okay. assaulted. And then, thir and then my badge number is thirteen oh five. Okay. And then I'm I, 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 I was in, you, as soon as we finish the okay. statements, I just want you to okay. shut everything down and then we'll go out and exactly what you guys can do. Okay. Okay. Yeah, he, he wants the camera turned off so he can talk to us. We'll allow that once. If it goes well, then we'll allow that more often. But we'll see what he has to say. Keep it ready though. Have something typed up ready to say this shit is stupid. Why don't you do that? Yeah. Most likely they're going to come after me though, so I don't know what he's... You got to remember, they sing of me out. Everyone in this town here. Actually, Tom doesn't like me very much now. <laughs> he doesn't really even know you. That's what's funny. He just knows he's the brother that came from Chicago. <laughs> I got two of them. <laughs> I was giving him and Trish shit at uh, KO. <laughs> Yelling at him. Yeah. Oh, the officers took my picture. <laughs> I had three of them following me around, taking my picture. They, they do that. They need that for their paperwork so they know who they're talking to. Yeah. They, they did that for both. I asked them if they wanted to, if they wanted me to pose, but he didn't think that was funny. I don't want to no, that was when Wesley Chen was stealing my chair. I didn't witness them taking it from you because I was in the middle or, stuff, but I do know for a fact you were there before anybody even Oh, maybe up. it was different. You were sitting there the whole time. I'm not sure if it was the same time. No, I wasn't over there. I got you the playback. So the officer, that one right there, walked up to me. He's like, you doing okay? Yeah. yeah. I was like, yeah, that's all. I'm not going to push it. Nah, he's a good guy. He is. <laughs> I've butted heads with uh, all of them a few times, but on a minor level. And they know I'm here to do a job, but they, they are too. They're actually cool. We have our asshole cops. I mean, and you'll, you'll get to know them real well, real quick. Santos. Well, he's, he's nuts, he's off his rocker. And then we got a nut guy at night that causes a lot of problems. But these guys here, they, they've taken a stand to uh, stay as much out of it. Missed all the excitement. Stay. There's all sorts of police reports yeah. for assault and theft. And yeah, I didn't do last time. You're off work? No. Oh, you didn't go to work yet? Are you working? On the weekends. Okay. <laughs> What's up? Go get your drink. Go get them. Okay, man. It's fine. Well, Here, I'll get it for you. Yeah, you can go get your drink. I'm not going to stop you. I'll just let you know. Okay, you don't, you don't have to be afraid. We're not going to hurt nobody, okay? I promise you. That's my guy. I know, but... I'm telling you, we're not going to hurt nobody, okay? Hello, buddy. Hey. What does the classification mean? I got all that. So, report number on these two meetings. What a day. Yeah, you know, <laughs> it happens. We all have jobs to do. We're here for a job just like you guys are, you know. I mean, 
That's why I keep trying to make a point. It's not against you, you, you guys you know personally, because you guys, we, you guys have been pretty cool. Every with time us. we come here, it's a learning experience. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, it, it's tough because th there is two sides to the story. You know, it, there is entities on both ends that need to be addressed, and it, it, it's hard. I understand that. That's why I try not to pick on you guys. You know, except for when something really gets crazy and out of whack, you know, like that, that's, to me, that's, that isn't something that normally has been going on, yeah. you know, you guys know that, that's not normal, you know, and that's where yeah, it's like, whoa, on the other. right, you know, <laughs> well, there's no reason to, it's not personally against you guys, we're, we're here doing a peaceful protest for a reason, I understand. and, you know, and when things get out of whack a little, you know, we got to make an address out of it, just like TFM has to make, address their issues that's yeah. distinct, you know, I mean, everybody has to play their, their cards the way they need to be played. But every once in a while, it just seems like it's getting, there's been a couple incidences where it just doesn't even seem remotely lawful how it was handled, you know, and it's like, whoa, come on, you know, but like I said, I understand your guys' position. That's why, I, you know, like I try not to be insulted to you guys. You might make a statement, just like you guys have to sometimes, yeah, you know. We're so we, we don't, you know, yeah, it's, yeah, it's not against you guys. Cause I fully understand your position. I, I, I'm a little bit, I I just, well, you know what, I mean, we respect you guys too. It's just, we're kind of in the middle, you know, you know our role in here. Right? Yeah. And it kind of sucks. That kind of sucks because you know what you know what it reminds me of, and I've talked yeah, about it before. Like this, can we not, can we just yeah, 